Hello everybody, welcome to another Monday Mischief. You are in for a treat today because, well, we're in for a, we're treat. In for a treat today because it's Advent! <laughs> you may not know this, but Advent does not necessarily start on the 1st of December. It's actually the season of Advent that leads up to Christmas starts on the fourth Sunday before Christmas. And this year, that was yesterday. Yeah. Yesterday, Sunday the 28th of November. So we are officially in Advent. Uh, we have our Christmas tree. We have our Advent candles behind me. Um, and we thought it'd be really fun because we know what happens when you get an Advent calendar. What's the first thing when you were a kid, what's the first thing that you do with an advent calendar, usually? Um, find the first door. Okay, no. Emily and I, this is another example of how we're quite different. Because when I got a chocolate advent calendar... I'd be like, what, what chocolate is it? The first thing I would do would be secretly open the top, take the tray out with all the chocolates in, eat all the chocolates and then put the tray back in. Because then you can still open the doors and no one knows you've eaten all the chocolates and get them all in one go. So that's what we're going to do as our challenge today. <laughs> I mean, I have eaten all of my advent calendar before Christmas, before. Okay. But I wouldn't do it on the first day because that's quite disappointing, isn't it? Not really, because you get Every a lot day, of chocolate. You then have no chocolate. No, save it for when you've just got no chocolate in the house and it's the only thing left. Christmas is a season where there's plenty of chocolate around though, so if you eat all of these, there's always just more chocolate. Not when you're a student. Okay. But, yeah. Fair enough. So we are, our challenge today is we are going to eat our way through this advent calendar as fast as possible, ignoring the calories, and we don't encourage um, unhealthy eating, but this is just for a bit of fun. Um, we have to eat them in order, yep. so we've got to go through the doors in the right order. First person to finish all the chocolate wins. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go. Number one's easy, because we both found it. Oh, we got a hair. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's getting them out of the things to drink apart. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, there it is. I think I'm behind. I'm on 12, what are you on? 12. 24. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so stiff. <laughs> I'm done. Me too. Oh! Instant replay, I think. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> that is so much trouble. I think that was like the exact same time. Oh, wow. I'm pretty sure that was an absolute dead heat. Well played. <laughs> <laughs> well played. I don't recommend doing that, in all honesty. As much as it sounds like fun. I quite enjoyed that. <laughs> it's fun up until about chocolate nine, maybe. After that, it's a bit of a mission. Yeah, um, when I got to 20, I just started opening the next doors and wait, and didn't actually eat the chocolates till I was ready for them. Because I couldn't fit any more in my mouth. I wasn't ready for them and just put them in my mouth anyway. <laughs> so... <laughs> there you go. Your tactic was probably better. But there we go. Hey, it's an eating challenge where we were about even, so I normally win all the eating challenges, un unsurprisingly. So. Great. Well, <laughs> whatever you're up to in the run to Christmas, we hope you have a fantastic advent and a lovely, lovely Christmas and get in the mood for it this year. Loads, there's quite a few Scrooges around this year that don't want it all to start and everyone's got their lights up early. I say go for it. And I'm normally a 1st of December kind of from no, that point on. But this year, I'm letting it ride. Go for it, enjoy Christmas, remember what it's all about. Uh, keep Jesus the reason for the season and uh, we will see you next week for another Monday Mischief for the second of our Advent challenges. We'll see you then, bye.